Dave Draper, the Blonde Bomber, passed away today at the age of 79. Draper was born in Secaucus, New Jersey on April 16, 1942. Always athletic, in high school he participated in wrestling and swimming, but was bitten by the weightlifting bug early at only 10 years of age. After winning the 1962 Mr. New Jersey competition he moved to California and worked for the Weeder Barbell Company until 1969. Draper was 6 feet tall and his competition weight was 235 pounds. With his blonde hair and good looks, it was not long before show business beckoned, with television work on shows such as The Monkees, The Beverly Hillbillies and Here Comes the Bride. Draper also appeared in a handful of movies in the 1960s, the most notable being Don't Make Waves, starring Tony Curtis, Claudia Cardinale and Sharon Tate. During this time he was also an active and serious competitor, winning the Mr. America, Mr. Universe and Mr. World contests. His last contest was the 1970 Narbi Universe, then the top competition in the world, where he placed third behind Reg Park and Arnold Schwarzenegger. Although he carried on training well into his 70s, he was in ill health in the last years of his life with persistent heart problems. Dave Draper was Arnold's idol, and he left an emotional tribute to his hero on Twitter today, where he wrote, Dave Draper was an inspiration to millions of people all over the world, including me. He was one of my idols. In Austria, I kept his photo on the wall above my bed for motivation, and when I saw him starring in Don't Make Waves, I thought, my dreams are possible. He was an amazing writer and a great family man. I will miss the blonde bomber, but his memory will always be with me. Draper leaves behind a wife and a young daughter.